Hi boys and girls, I'm back and I wanted to try a fun little activity with you. So I asked Everly to help me out and we know that Easter is in two days. So we oh thought we, oh my God. So we thought we'd do, I'm so excited. <laughs> she's excited. <laughs> so we thought we'd do a little activity with some Easter eggs. So I know I gave you some ideas to do sight words with Easter eggs. Yeah. This is similar to that. So what you're gonna need is some plastic eggs. Yes. Maybe like 10, not maybe, too many. Maybe like 86. <laughs> maybe 86, but that'd be a lot. As many as you wanna do. Maybe like, we started with eight today actually. Yeah. Um, you are going to need to number them. I just used a sharp, Sharpie. You're gonna put numbers one through 10 or one through eight, whatever you do on each egg. Yeah. And then you're gonna need some letters. I have magnet letters, but if you don't have letters, you can use, um, can like, you write them? yeah, you can write them on paper and then you can put the paper in here. Um, but the idea is that they are separate. So if you have three letters, you're going to have three pieces of paper in the end and you'll see how we do it in a second. Then you're going to need a little basket to put them in. It could be a bowl if you don't have a basket. And then you're going to make an easy paper just like this with however yeah. many you're doing. You're going to leave enough space so that you can write the word and then you're gonna draw a picture. So I made them a little big. Yeah. All right, okay. so there is a few different ways you can make this harder or easier, but I'll just show you how to play first. So Everly is gonna pick an egg. Okay. Five. Okay, good. So now she has egg five. Now before we open it, let me tell you what I did. I put a bunch of letters in here and today for Everly we're going to make CVC words. Oh my god. So Everly, what is a CVC word? How many letters does it have? Three. Three letters. And what is special about the letter in the middle? It's a vowel. It's a vowel, right? And our vowels are the letters that are pink, pink on the foundation cards. So, e, is pink, so e for Everly, e. e is a vowel, A, I, O, and U. Those are our five vowels. And those letters are going to be in the middle of the word when we are doing our foundations, when we're doing our CVC words. Oh. So, that's going to help us out in a second. So, now Everly is going to open up my egg. My purple egg. She has number five. I'm just going to be working on number five here. Okay. In her egg, she has three, three. letters. And she's going to try to mix them up. make a word. Okay. So what can we make? Let's see. This is going to be a B. Now, oh, I see something good that you did right away. I did. What did you do with this? Put the A that way. She put the A in the middle because it's the vowel. So it has to go in the middle. The A can't go all the way at the end. It has to be in the middle. So that's going to help her out. Now, I think I know you think you know what that word is? Yeah. Now, you might know it, but can you tap it out? The A that's very good, Everly. And we're going to now write the word bat in number five. Can I do it, Mommy? Yeah, you're going to write it, not me. <laughs> you're going to write bat. Okay, Mommy. Number five, all right. Number five, good. Where can I put it? Right here, it's fine. B. Mm hmm Good. Let's tap that one more time. Ba, ba at, bat. bat. Good. And then I said she could draw a picture too. So bat could be like some a bat flying. Or there's another thing for bat. What? What else could a bat be? Uh, a baseball bat. Yeah. So I'm gonna let you pick. You can do either a flying bat or a baseball bat. Baseball bat. Okay, so she's gonna draw that right there. 
So another way that you could make this a little bit harder would be to add some words with digraphs into the egg, which would give you more like four letter words. So a digraph is like CH, so you could do the word chip, C-H-I-P, and you can, prob you can fit four letters in here, I've tried before. So you could do no. digraph words instead of just CVC words. A baseball bat. Okay, good, Everly, good. So then she's gonna go through and she's gonna pick out all the eggs and she's gonna tap them out. She's gonna try to make words with them. Um, and that's really the goal of this. And it's pretty simple. The biggest thing I want them to know is that the vowel is in the middle and that's gonna help them when they are trying to make the words. It's gonna make it a little easier if they put the vowel in the middle. Oh. And if you don't have these magnet letters, which probably a lot of people don't have them, um, if you don't have them, like we said before, you can just write the letters on little pieces of paper. And I would try to do the vowels a different color, just how these are. So that kind of helps them realize which one is the vowel. And what else did I want to say? Um, I think there's, even if you want to make this even easier, that's another thing I was going to say. You could even try it with just letters inside of the eggs for some of the kindergarten kids. You could put, just put letters inside instead of a CVC word. If they're not ready for the CVC word yet, you could just put one letter inside. And that's what I was going to try with Logan later. Okay? <laughs> just put one letter inside. Let Logan's them, my brother. Yeah. Put the letter inside. Have them take it out. Identify it. Letter is T. And have them write it down. T. And then they could draw a picture of something with the letter T. Um, but this is something I do a lot in school usually this week. So we didn't get to do it since we weren't at school. So I wanted to show you how to do it at home. And it's something fun and pretty easy. And you can change it around however it works for you. Uh, one other thing, if you are writing a CVC words and they're having trouble writing them or they're writing them too big, I like to sometimes put them in boxes like this. I three boxes. And then they can do B, A, T. It helps them just to set it up a little bit easier and, and neater. And again, it's those three boxes. So it reiterates the, that there's three letters in the CVC words. Um, all right, have fun with this. And we hope you all have a happy Passover and a happy Easter. And you are enjoying your time home. And we will see you soon. Bye.